Hello, my name is Chef Joe Sakers, and I'm coming from Delaware Technical and Community College to talk about mother sauces. Do you know what mother sauces are? Mother sauces are the foundation for the entire classic French repertoire of hot sauces. They are distinguished by the liquids and thickeners used to make them. They can be seasoned and garnished to create a wide variety of smaller sauces. So there's five basic mother sauces. We have a white bechamel sauce. We have a white velouté sauce. We have a brown espagnol sauce. We have a red tomato sauce and a yellow hollandaise sauce. It is easy to remember the sauces if you think of the color that they're associated with. The five mother sauces, bechamel is a white sauce. It is milk that has been thickened with a white roux. A roux is 50% flour and 50% fat and that will thicken the milk and create a bechamel sauce. A velouté is a white stock, most often used as fish or chicken, that is thickened with a white roux. Espagnol is a brown sauce. The brown sauce is made by beef stock or a brown veal stock that is thickened with a brown roux, which is just roux that has been cooked a little bit longer. And then we have tomato sauce. Tomato sauce is a red sauce that is made by taking tomatoes and onions and peppers and cooking them down in a white stock, preferably a chicken stock or a veal stock. Hollandaise is a yellow sauce. It is clarified butter and egg yolks emulsified. Okay? Some of the derivatives or small sauces used to make the mother sauces. Bechamel, you can make a Mornay sauce, which is a cheese sauce, the most notably known for in macaroni and cheese. You could also make cream of broccoli soup with it. And you just take a bechamel, which is a milk-based sauce, and you puree broccoli into that, with some onions. And then we have velouté. Some of the derivatives of velouté would be a sauce used to make chicken pot pie, or a sauce suprême. Sauce suprême is taking a velouté and adding cream to that. And then we have espagnol. Espagnol derivative is something we use called demi-glace. Demi-glace is when you take half stock and half espagnol, and then you reduce that by half, hence the demi. And then we have a hunter sauce. Hunter sauce is no more than shallots, garlic, and mushrooms sauteed down and then added to the espagnol. Then the tomato sauce. The tomato sauce derivative would be a ragu. Ragu is basically a ground meat. Could be pork, could be beef, or chicken. Ground and then the addition of the tomato sauce, most notably known in a uh, pasta dish called baked ziti. Tomato, another derivative of tomato sauce would be a blush sauce, where you could take a bechamel or just straight cream and combine that with a tomato sauce that would create a blush sauce, not only used in the Italian cuisine as a vodka sauce. And then we have hollandaise sauce. So a derivative of hollandaise sauce would be the most notably used for eggs benedict, would be a bernaise. A bernaise is when you have a reduction of tarragon and shallots and wine that is reduced down or the sauce Chiron, which is just hollandaise with a little bit of tomato paste stirred into that. So that is the lesson on the five mother sauces. The best way to remember that is the colors. Bachamel and Velouté being white, Espanol being brown, tomato being red, and hollandaise being yellow. Thank you very much.